All right. I'm Chris and I'm going to take you through how I rig the wetter and uh, share with you all the tips I can. So we've got our wetter here um, and I've got my three sail bags and the four bag all set to go as they came off the trailer. So we'll crack into it. So first we undo the Cunningham line which secures the tramps on uh, and the main sheet at the back. I'll also be showing you how to derig the boat and uh, show you exactly how I leave it because that's quite important to ensure a, a quick rig up. So first we start off pulling the floats off. Balance point, have your left hand on the front knuckle and uh, you should be able to lift that quite easily. And then I don't force any of this, it's just a matter of getting the right alignment and pushing it in. Now while I'm here, it's important to save time, so I do as many things as I can. I undo the mast, I'll undo the side stay from the trampoline here and unravel it. And a trick, I run these over the front of the trampoline and just leave the end dang back. I'll explain that later. Also while I'm here, I can tie the trampoline on. I've left it derigged like this, so I just take the dead end and I tie it through the block here with the bowline and then loop the line on there so that leaves me a 3 to 1 purchase at the front right, other side So next I want to tension the trampolines, so I'll grab the trampoline from the inner of the sleeve and I'll pull that quite tight, loop it around the block and then this end again, tension it up, put it in the cleat, tramp's good to go. While I'm here I also undo the mask, so this bottom section is free to come off, I'll slide it out and just place it on the boat there, ready to go. Here to the other side, same deal. I just pull this end through, and by pulling the one line, it tensions up the front, loop it around the block, and then tension the back. You'll see the beam slid in a little there. I, I didn't have it all the way in, so the trampoline takes care of that. Got the tension. Next, undo the top section of the mast. Pull that out. All right, and then I just go straight into the bottom section here. Slot it together, make sure it's all aligned. And then I'm just gonna put the mast further up the boat and sit it there so it's nice and stable to run my halyards, which I'll grab now. <laughs> 